Hello family, welcome to another edition of my creative design challenge. In my previous episode, I demonstrated how to create the Assassin Radio logo and I hope you loved it and you were able to try your hands on it. In today's episode, I'm going to demonstrate how to create some of the stunning flyers that they have. So, check it out. So, go to file, create a new file. And so, I would make it a 1920 by 1920 pixels. Create the artboard. So, since we have been able to create the artboard, the next thing to do is to import um, one one of the uh, the I'd wanted to create this, but okay, let me create. Okay, so we have the two images there, but we'll start with this. Now, one thing that you can find within all of this is that they've created a custom background. They have this image of Kojo Mins and the host, an image of the guest, as well as the time for the program, the date, and then beneath is, is the social media handles. In my previous videos, I demonstrated how to create the various social media logos. Example, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. If you haven't watched those videos yet, you can still check my channel out for those videos. So let's start by creating the background that we have in there. So go to your shape tool and then select this rectangle. So I'm creating the first rectangle here. Now what I'll do is to select the background color. So I go in for this brown here and that is the first one. The next item is, I think what they did was to create an irregular shape of this round circles that they have there. So what I'll do is to go to my logo and then select these two here, control C and then a control V. So at this point, I think one, two, three, four, four rings. So let me paste this here again. Select one, select two, and then resize this. Alright, so since we have been able to create this, I think all we need to do is to just create a warp. Let me just create a warp just by doing that and then um, I bring that here, resize this element. And I'll just hold the Alt key and then drop this here also hold the drop the, the alt key again and then bring this to the side so after doing this i need to make sure that i have the same color that we they have over here so i think one other thing that you can try is to select all select all of this and then change the opacity to about 10 and I think this will be a yeah, great so the next thing to do is to en enclose this thing in a shape because I don't like how they are falling out here so I'll just draw a rectangle shape over this then select all of these items select all of these select all of that and then I'll just go to um, click control seven. And I think what we have been able to create 
is similar to the item that they have over there yeah so go to your layer palette click the background shape and then lock it click the immediate item we just created and lock that also the next thing that we're going to do is to import the logo that we created so i'm going to select all control g then control c and then i'll paste it here so resize resize it so today we are just creating without any form of dimension and so if you take a look at the logo that they have over here the the, the shape that they have in there is white and as i see it's also white and then we need to change breakfast and um, the text radio to breakfast show so let's try that double click to select this item or you can come to the layers palette and then select it um, each item over here so i select that that's the first shape here and then change it to white the next thing is to also change asasi to white double click change to white then the voice of our land i'll just disable that and then also 99.5 let me disable that and then type this as breakfast and then duplicate so hold the alt and shift and then say show now i think the breakfast show is in italics and then the font is bold so let me go in for extra bold italic and then this is also extra bold italic and then the color the two colors also match up with the rings so yeah this has been done escape escape and then yes we have been able to create a similar item here now the next thing that we would want to do is to bring a similar um, an image here so let me still i created a png of myself so let me just import that oops yeah so i'll just drop that over here um yeah so i think this is fine since i've been able to import this and i don't want anything um disturbing my workflow all i need to do is to lock it so layers click on the toggle lock and then i have it locked so when i click on it nothing will happen the next thing to do is to create the space for the social media handles yeah so what i can do is to use my ruler to check where to have these items dropping at so yeah so i can create go select the rectangle tool and create the first shape that is this is supposed to be white so use the eyedropper tool to select white the next item is to create the shape for the host name and that is the brown um, the golden yellow color so just use the eyedropper tool and then select it the next item is to have the space or the, the shape for the host so just use the rectangle tool again and then yes so what i can do is to still come here double click on it to select white so i have these items created what we will also want to do is to import the icons we created in our previous episode so let me go to file and then open
open facebook design yes we have something here now let me go and pick up the instagram logo and the final one is the twitter logo okay so let me import the first one that is do i have okay so let me pick this facebook and then just drop it and i think it is way too big so but i'll still leave it here so i can close this one now the second item to import is, is the instagram logo Control G to group all of them and then I drop that also onto the space now I can close this now let's import the Twitter Twitter okay I think um, this looks perfect okay so control G so now let me select all and then resize them all. Alright, so with all of the items selected i can just um, i just want to make it the brown color so let me select the brown and then drop this here this looks perfect now the next thing to do is to have the name that they have typed over here so see radio 99.5 So I'm going to assassin radio 99.5 and I make sure I can go in for medium change the text size to 60 and then drop it here the next item is that they have the website we haven't created the website so the website icon so what i'll do is to say um, oops sorry okay so b s uh, okay so i think this is perfect this is also okay the next item is that we have kojo main sign here and so i'll just type kojo main sign but since we have bright over there let me just type bright or sina no yeah i think this is perfect and they have it the color is white so double click and change this to white the next item is we want to have host over here so go for your text tool again type host and the color is brown they are golden um, they are they are brown and yes so I think the, yes we, we we're getting somewhere the next item we want to do is to create the time so let me bring in a ruler then I go for my pen tool 
time is 5 30 a.m. to 10 a.m. and yeah let me just align it here the color is white and we need the date so hold the alt and then drop this here the date 21st February 2022 and the color let me select this the last items we need to create is this image and the guest with a name so what we'll do is to create the ellipse tool and activate the ellipse tool hold the alt and shift key to draw the circle next thing to do is to create this smaller circle for guest so go for your ellipse tool again and then create a smaller circle for the guest change that to white go for your text tool and type guest now you want to change the color to the brown and then just drop that here okay so guest the next is the name of the person so i think i'll need i'll need an image to use let's import an image Since we've been able to import this gentleman onto the page, all we need to do is to bring our circle up that is it's supposed to be on top of the image so that we can create our clipping mask. So I just bring this up here and then send his image closer. I select the, the image and then the shape that I want to create the clipping mask within. So select the image and then the, the circle. Now control seven and we have this one here. That's beautiful. The next thing that I would want to do is maybe I would want to create an outer circle. I think this this makes it look cool change this to white then my guest and this background shape I'll just bring them all forward and yes the next thing to do is to type the name of the person the name of the person and then a portfolio the person holds yeah so let's Hold the alt key drop this one down here hamid h naughty he's an artist check him out you love his paintings He's a professional artist, a graf graffiti artist. And yes, we've been able to create a replica of the Asasi Breakfast Show, hosted by 
Senano Agbosu. Tell me, how do you like what we've just created? If you love what I just created, just hit on the like button, type in your comment below, subscribe to my channel, and also invite all other persons who want to learn how to design. Invite them onto this channel, let them also subscribe, let them learn, and then watch every other video I'll be posting. Thank you very much for watching.